while women in Hollywood have started sharing their stories about alleged sexual harassment by Harvey Weinstein, and others have thrown their support, some men are also coming forward to back their colleagues. In the days after an explosive New York Times article detailing decades of allegations against the Oscar winning producer, some Hollywood actors and directors have voiced their own disgust. To be clear, what Harvey Weinstein did was a disgusting abuse of power and horrible. Mark Ruffalo tweeted Sunday. I hope we are now seeing the beginning of the end of these abuses. Jeff Bridges, whose 2014 movie The Giver was distributed by the Weinstein Company, told The Hollywood Reporter that Weinstein is facing his demons now. Director James Gunn posted an extensive note on Facebook about Weinstein, as well as similar accusations against other powerful men. As we've discovered lately with the numerous sexual allegations against Harvey Weinstein, Bill Cosby, Roger Ailes, and Bill O'Reilly, sexual predators have no political affiliation. They are Republicans, Democrats, Communists, Nazis, Green Party, Whigs, and whatever the hell else is out there. But they also know no status or occupation. Yesterday, I tweeted that if even one-tenth of the stories about Harvey Weinstein are true, and I believe they are, then good fucking riddance. Fuck him and everyone, who enabled him to get away with such behavior. The tweets got a lot of news coverage, and I got a lot of responses. One of the primary responses was that sexual predation is a terrible problem. For Hollywood, he wrote.